Now, with respect to Three Eye Atlas, this, it was discovered on July 1st, 2025, by a small telescope, half a meter in size, because it's bright. And if you translate its brightness, uh, you find that it has to have a diameter of somewhere between 20 and 46 kilometers if what we are seeing is a reflection of sunlight from a solid surface. Uh, it's not obvious because you might argue maybe there is a cloud of dust. However, if there was dust uh, around a, a much smaller nucleus, then the dust would be pushed behind the object by solar radiation pressure. We know that from comets. We see a cometary tail behind them. And the Hubble Space Telescope looked at this object on uh, July uh, 21st, took a very high resolution image. There was no tail behind it. We saw glow ahead of the object towards the sun. That was not seen before. Uh, it's sort of an anti-tail. Instead of a tail behind the object, there is something preceding it ahead of it towards the sun. But um, the other issue is that if it's uh, such a huge giant rock, uh, the way that my colleagues are arguing, uh, then it's a million times more massive than the previous two interstellar objects that were found.